Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your love tarot card reading now. So let's find out what's going on in your love life. So let's see. The first card that I'm looking at is indicating to me that there's this defensive energy, this sort of cautious energy, not being able to let your guard down. Okay, so there could be something that is occurring in your love life that is making you, you know, really feel like, you know, you can't trust someone feels as if there's a lack of trust, there's an inability to open up. It could be this individual as well that is struggling to open up their heart to you, okay? So I'm picking up this energy of not being able to trust as well, okay? I feel like the two of you might have been through so much that both of you have been fighting one another or having this great grand difficulty play out in the course of your life, okay? Now, the next energy is showing to me that for some of you, there might be, you know, this other energy of not being able to go beyond this, okay? This energy is reflecting celebrations and happiness. So I feel like the two of you haven't been feeling happy for a long time, right? The two of you have been feeling dissatisfied and um, disgruntled by what has been occurring in your life so far. So you're not happy with the situation. This individual is not happy with the situation. Both of you are highly aggravated. And I'm seeing that both of you are hoping for more peace. You know, I feel like you're trying to be patient. They're trying to be patient. But the essence of this card is talking about healing. And so what I get is, you know, there's a need for healing. So obviously something must have happened before this, for this energy to come up and indicate the need for that healing energy to bring things back to this sort of settle down, harmonious, you know, frequency. I'm seeing that uh, someone is uh, not allowing the other to take care of them, or perhaps someone is, um, you know, not providing for the other. It could be emotionally, could be mentally as well. Okay, someone is holding back kindness, generosity, and this sort of uh, energy, you know. It could also come from the fact that uh, one individual is not wanting to show much love or care or affection in this situation. So in the past, I feel like someone developed feelings for the other, right? And the energies are showing to me that these feelings were pretty strong. And it might have been, you know, the excitement of trying to establish what this means, what it can mean in light of the situation. So I feel like the two of you may have been on the verge of falling in love or starting to, you know, know one another on a deeper level. And I feel like it was getting, uh, you know, 
much more serious than you anticipated and I'm feeling from the energies that you wanted more and they wanted more as well. Okay, so that's what I'm picking up from the cards right now. Okay, so the next energy is showing to me this toxic energy, this energy of feeling stuck, unable to move forward, unable to do anything at this point of time to get things going. So where is this coming from, you know? This energy is suggesting to me that things started off good and then got really downhill, okay? And not in a good way. I feel like all of a sudden the two of you were in this uh, very deep sort of emotional roller coaster and things were getting worse and worse and worse. And I feel like someone was reaching out to the other to save them. And it was difficult to do so. You know, I definitely feel like the two of you were very uh, limited in terms of what you could do in respect of this relationship. The next card is showing to me that they're trying to be patient. They're trying to take their time. They're trying to understand their feelings, their emotions. They're trying to understand everything in relation to what is going on and why it's happening, you know. And I feel like this person is searching for something. Searching for something either inside of you or within themselves. And this whole process has been a journey of exploration, a journey of trying to understand you know, everything. In hindsight, I do feel like they've been looking for, you know, some sort of answer, some sort of deep discovery, you know. So it hasn't been easy for this person. I can definitely tell that throughout the course of the situation, there has been some difficulties that um, have led them to feel confused, led them to feel like, you know, they don't have the answers. Someone went into a very deep denial in the situation. It's like they didn't want to face it. They didn't want to look at it. They didn't want to understand it. They didn't want to see it, right? Yes, I'm seeing from the cards that there's this fear of conflict. I feel like this person is watching you, right? Watching you very carefully. Wondering when to take action, wondering when will be the right time. But also, you know, there's other things that are going on here in the background of the situation. So let's look at this toxic energy. Yes, I see that there's an inability to figure out what to do in this situation. Someone wants the games to end, otherwise they're going to walk away, okay? And I'm seeing here from the cards that one individual, you know, even though there's that energy of wanting to walk away, this could be you or this could be this individual concerned, you know, but the games have to stop. The sort of silliness has to end. You know, I do feel like the energies are calling for that. Let's see. What are the other messages for Capricorn? Okay, so I'm just going to reshuffle these cards. Yes, there's a need for change in the situation, right? And I feel like you know, these changes, they come along with like life's ups and downs. 
And, you know, this relationship is in a state of transformation right now. And you might be feeling overwhelmed. You might be feeling like you don't have the answers. I'm definitely picking up, you know, in terms of this individual's energy, they have very strong desires, wishes, and uh, feelings, okay? And um, I'm feeling like this individual wants to change things around, you know? They want change. They are wanting to develop their own sort of individuality as well, you know, in the course of the situation. And I feel like they are trying to figure out who they are, okay? So this is a process of learning, okay? So what I get from this tarot card reading is that some things need to change here. The games need to stop. The truth, you need to be honest with your feelings. I hope you guys enjoyed your tarot card reading. If you're interested in bonus videos that are going to be offered on this channel, complimentary videos, do check out the Patreon link in the description box below. I will be doing additional videos that will not be available on YouTube or any other platform for you guys. Okay. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.